So okay, this is Woods here, and uh, I'm back here to show you the reason I received this package. I'm not going to show you the address. I don't know what's in it, but we're going to open her up. I received it from a person who I'm subscribed to that I recommend you subscribe to. It's a traditional black powder. His name is Lewis, and um, he has a really good channel for all you folks who like to do black powder shooting like I do and um, are into traditional uh, bushcraft and stuff, then I, I'd recommend you check out Lewis's channel. I'll put it down in the link, uh, down in the description, his, his uh, link to his channel. Anyway, uh, don't know what's in there. I knew something was coming. He told me he was going to send me something. I mean, thank you so much, uh, Lewis. Uh, I'm going to open this up. And I'm going to cover the address there, and I'm just going to show you there was a little damage uh, that incurred during shipping, so uh, there we go. Yeah. And we'll see. We'll use this little paper opener here, and we'll open up, see what's in there. Uh, set to priority mail. Oh wow, I can already tell. That looks like a knife inside a sheet. Oh boy. Wow. <laughs> Tie the knot here. Okay, there's a note here. This is Hi Dave, that's me. Been enjoying watching your videos. Looks like you enjoy traditional type knives, so I thought I would pass this one to you. Hope you enjoy. Hope you enjoy it. Regards, Lewis. Wow. That's uh, like a mini bush lore or something. I've heard of these. I've never actually seen one in person. Let's see. Ooh, look at that. Oh, man. No way. Check it out. See if that'll focus. I mean, whoa, that is razor sharp. I mean, that is razor. Wow. I'm thinking neck knife. That's what I'm thinking. I love carrying a neck knife sometimes, and and I'm thinking neck knife. If if you notice in my vehicle, I have a an empty sheath hanging from my uh, rear view mirror, and I used to have a uh, I used to have a, a a neck knife in there, and I lost it. And wow, this is awesome! Beautiful leather sheath, cal, uh, condor emblem there. Condor uh, knives. They're they're a great company. They just make excellent stuff for just good quality for. And every year they get better. I mean, they just get better every year. Look at that. There's the El Salvador. I hope the light's good enough in here. And a condor. And I'm telling you guys, let's see. I want to keep that. I want to keep that letter there. But I'll just take a little corner off that, okay, Lewis? I won't. Oh, man. Wow. She's razor sharp. This is beautiful. Scandi Grind. Uh, I believe it's a mini bush lore. I don't know that much about the bush lore knives, but man, that's going to be a great addition to my kit. I just don't know how to thank you enough. Wow, that just blows me away. Wow. Thank you so much, Lewis. I just turned, uh, the other, just recently, I just turned 62, so this is my, uh, 
my birthday gift, I reckon. And um, that's awesome. Thank you so much. Whew. Wow. Yeah, the people on the, in the bushcraft community are just, uh, their generosity just blows me away. It's amazing. Wow. Um, look, you all who don't know Lewis or haven't uh, checked out his channel, Traditional Black Powder, check it out. This guy, uh, I mean, I never, I, wow, I just never imagined. I'm blown away. I just uh, am touched. Thank you so much. So, big, uh, big surprise. I got, you know, I was thinking, oh, he's probably going to send me some, I knew he was sending me something. I thought maybe he was going to send me some wood scales or something to put on a knife for him. Well, maybe this is the knife and the wood scales haven't shown up yet. No, I'm just kidding. Anyway, well, thanks again. Thank you so much. This is Woods Runner from Montana, and um, I'm just uh, impressed. Thank you so much. We'll talk to you all later. This is Woods, out.